up everybody, Q Ever 2000 here, welcome to another episode of Pokemon Platinum. In the last episode, we caught... Oh, I put him in the PC. We caught Rotom, and we named him Dingle. We caught him on the first Premiere Ball at full health, I can't even believe. And also off screen, as, as you saw in that clip, um, at the end of last episode, our, our egg hatched into a Togepi and named it Pancake for reasons of crisp. And look, it needs six experience to level up. That's, you, I don't think you can possibly get lower than, like, I don't think you can get, like, lower than 10 in this game. Um, so, receive the egg. Oops, okay. Uh, likes dry food, so it's stats. <laughs> um, and it was growling and charm, so it can't even attack. But Togepi, if you want to train it, it's hard to train, but if you want to, um, it'll evolve into Togetic, and then if you use a shiny stone, well, if you have high enough friendship, it'll evolve into Togetic, and then... If you, you have a shiny stone, it'll evolve into Togekiss, which is a very good normal flying type. Very diverse move pool. It can learn Aura Sphere, which is really cool. So, I'd actually very much recommend Togekiss. And I already spoiled what this cave was. It is Mount Coronet. And we're actually going to be needing to go through here to get to the next place. And hey, look, it's Cyrus. I haven't seen him for a while. Actually, we have seen him recently. According to 1.3, Mount Coronet was where the Sin region began. So, yeah, we can't get through here until, um... Until um, we've beaten the Eternal Gym and saved the place from Team, uh, saved the building from Team Logic. So, should have been Nose Drive. What became of that world? Because the human spirit is weak and incomplete. Strife is spread. The world's being ruined by it. I find the state of affairs to be deplorable. Wow, thanks for pushing us. <laughs> okay. Uh, radio. I, I don't like the bike you see in this game. I really actually don't like the bike you see in this game at all. And hey, it's a Meditite. Uh, Meditite is a fighting psychic type. That's a pretty unique type. Um, I don't really... I've never used a Meditite before, but their stats aren't the greatest. And I think the final evolution of Meditite just looks weird. So, I I personally wouldn't go for Meditite, but it's not bad at all. It's a perfectly fine Pokemon. So, if you want to use Meditite, then you can. And anyway, we're... Wait, what route is this? Let me go back in. And go back out. Or you can just look at the freaking sign. This is Route 208. Uh, let's see, what's up here? Do I really want- I don't really know. Right, who's in front right now? Um... Let's put Rocks Perez in front, because I think it'll be helpful. Except there are hikers around here, so let's put Bowen back in front. Because we have to fight this hiker up here. Okay, player defeated Hiker Robert. Yeah, because you only have one Pokemon, you're not even evolving it. When you- when you- can, when you- like, you can. Just don't want to- okay, now let's put- Put Rot Perrette out in front. Alright. Let's continue on. So there's actually a Pokemon that you can find here that I'm not going to use, but that Pokemon is Ralts, which is a very good Psychic type. I actually quite recommend it. Anyway, what's in here? Berry Master says, ooh, free berries available. Okay. Let's go in here and see what, see what there is. I take it this guy's over. Yep. Yeah. The Pomeg Berry. What does that do? I don't know what that does. Right, let's see. Uh, right. It, using a Pokemon makes it more friendly, but also lowers its base. Oh, okay. So I guess if you want to make a fr if you want to make your Pokemon's friendship higher, you can use that, but you'll lower its base HP. So moves like Sonic Boom or Dragon Ridge might have more effect, but moves like Endeavor will get better. Right, let's continue on into. Heart Home City. Okay, and there's an exclamation mark. It's a bunny. Smash. Thank goodness that you happen to be there. Where are you? Who knows far how far away my bunnyery could have run? Bunnyery. That's a really weird name. Back in the Pokemon, you go. I'm here at Pokemon concerts. Be sure to drop in cocktails like Maggie probably. Yeah, where are you? Rock me. So anyway, if you try to go down here. You get green stocked by these people. Like, you try to go down here, and they're like, no. Yeah, so you can't actually go down there, so that's when well, you can later. But we have two more gyms to complete before there. So, anyway, this is Heart Home City, where stuff happens. There's actually one thing I want to show. I think it's in this, this house where you can get the item. It's a very good item. Do you give it to us? 
Okay, one of these people gives you an item that's actually quite good. Um, yeah, but anyway, Heart Home City, there's a gym in the city. That's what we'll be taking on. Right, go out. I think this person gives it to you. Yeah. All right, so we get the Shell Bell. The Shell Bell is a very good item. The Shell Bell basically, let's see, where is it? The Shell Bell, um, oh yeah, that, that scientist who was Don's father said, oh, you need to see 35 Pokemon, he gave us the EXP share, which is an item where if you give it to Pokemon, they will gain extra EXP. We don't need that right now, but, um, it's actually very good. Uh, so the Shell Bell holds the HP, uh, uh it's, it's a thing that you give to Pokemon, and its HP will be restored a little every time it inflicts damage. I just completely read that off of there, but it's actually quite good, so we're gonna give it to... Uh, let's give it to Rod Sprouts, because it is less HP. Oh, yeah, and also, so I said, I said, I think, I, one of the recent episodes, I said that the upgrade was used to evolve Por uh, Porygon 2 into Porygon Z. It's actually, it's actually used to evolve Porygon into Porygon 2 by Link Trade. Uh, you need, I think, the Dewey's disc to, evo to um, evolve Porygon 2 into Porygon Z. Alright, I think this guy gives you something. Oh, never mind. No, I know where it is. Nah, this guy's not. You shouldn't apologize for that. He is. I, mean, I don't even know what I'm talking about. Uh, the Poppin House? No. There's another house that actually gives you something very good. I think it's actually this house. I'm not too sure. Yes, it is. So, if you talk to this person. Oh, you're a trainer. That means you're using Pokemon boxes. I love meeting and you. I don't even know what you said. I don't know. My name's Bebe. You know Pokemon PC boxes? I'm the assistant administrator. I know this is out of blue. Do you want Pokemon named Eevee? Alright, so we got an Eevee, which is a very good Pokemon. Eevee can evolve into seven different Pokemon. I'm just gonna name it, um. So we're not going to be using Eevee, but Eevee can evolve into seven different types of Pokemon. Um, a Flareon, a Jolteon, a Vaporeon, a Leafeon, a Glaceon, an Espeon, and an Umbreon. And then there's a new one, I don't know what it's called, but I've heard. And anyway, we named it Bad Falafel. It's at level 20, so there are many different ways to evolve Eevee. Um, see, it knows, it knows fairly bad moves. It only knows one attack move, and that's Tackle. So it's a bit hard to train up, but it's the payoff is is very good. Eevee's a very very good Pokemon. Alrighty-o, so this this is the contest hall right here. Um, but we are actually going to be going to the gym. Well, we would be if this guy wasn't be talking. Hey there, how's it going, trainer? Being here tells me you're going to challenge the gym leader. Pay to break to you, but that's impossible. You're questioning why, and the answer is she's not here. Not to worry though. She has come. Okay, so we do have to go to the contest hall. Radio. Can I get off the bike? I hate the bike music in this game. In Harkle and Soul Silver, it's actually quite good, but in this game, it's just awful. Well, it's not awful. That, that I'm, I'm being too hard on, but I don't like it that much. Hey, look, it's our mom. How'd she get here? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need to thank you for earlier. Please take this accessory. I want to make it like a voice for Joe, or not. Put that accessory- No, that's horrible. <laughs> that's, just, that's just terrible. I don't know why I even tried to do that. Radio. Okay, yeah, let's not even- Okay. Don't talk to me, don't talk to me- Ugh. Okay, a little vacation. That's- I don't even know. <laughs> Tuxedo! Right, uh, Sorry. Okay, so I might cover the contest later, but I'm not gonna do them now because I find them boring. Uh, actually, no, that's unfair. I like, I think the contests are fun, but only when you're playing with friends. So anyway, this is Fantina, the gym leader of Heart Home, is also a contestant. She is how do you say Trey Fantastic. Fantina, being myself, get your. I was about to say some bad words, but <laughs> I didn't. Get yourself back to the gym. <laughs> Alright, so I guess that's where we are heading off next. I think we still have some time. 
we don't have to challenge the gym leader, you fools, but we have time to go in the gym. Gym kind of wicked, what's going on? I thought you first pitch back. Okay, so we have to find the blue tile and then go through the right door. So you don't even need to look at the blue tiles, you have a, a certain amount of chance, because, well, on the first time there are three doors, okay, the thing is a square, I think, okay, yeah, so on the first time, uh, you have a certain chance of getting through here without even looking at the tile, but for this one's easy, whoa, avoid the trainers, um, but for the second one, there are four doors, and the tile is harder to see, because it gets darker, I don't even, I don't even know where the tile is, um, yeah, this way, Okay, so we're gonna try to fight as little trainers as possible. Uh, I figure the towel would be okay. No, where is it? Where are you, you sneaky little tile? Come out before. I oh, there it is. It is. It wait, hold on. I get a point. It is a moon. Okay. Right. Moon. Is this a moon? Please be a moon. That. What is that? That's oh, a heart. Hold on, heart. Star. Star. What's this? Yes, moon. Wow, we got through that without fighting any trainers. That's awesome. Alrighty, so I guess that's it for this episode. So next time on Pokemon Platinum, we will be taking on the third gym leader. Thank you all for watching. See you guys all later.